Hello, so this video is all about how to do the green screen effect where you take out the green and you add in a background. So I'm gonna show you a video here where I've done it um, in my project. Cancel, sorry. Um, let me zoom in a little bit here. Um, so you have a couple things that you wanna, <sighs> sorry, I forget that sometimes my scroll bar. Okay, so I have a green screen video here. You want to put that in your main video. So that's like the first video line, which is often called video one, but I called it main video. And then you want to create a new video line where you add in the background. If you do it upside down, you won't see the green screen. You only see the background. So it's a little bit about like the layers. So in our main video, you want to put your green screen video. And this is what it, the finished product looks like. Then in your background, um, you can search... Uh, if you search in here for uh, news, you'll find a background. So there are like some newsroom. Here's a news portal one, breaking news control room, viewing monitor, um, broadcast news, like whatever background you want to be in front of. There's a lot of different options here, multi-screen, video, blue tinted studio control room. You have a lot of options. So you want to put that in your second one. So you open up your video with the green screen and you want to double click. And you have some menus at the top here. You want to click uh, this one. So that's where you'll find it. I'm going to do a new video so you can see me um, putting it in. And so I can actually go through all these steps. So here's another green screen video that I did as a sample. I'm just going to drag that right there. Okay. So I'm going to open this up. And I'm going to come, usually it starts off here. And you want to go to this one with the person in the white background. That's your key, a hint, right? <laughs> Look at me doing this. Oh, okay. You know, you got to laugh on a Thursday afternoon. So you want to click this little dropper. This is like a, a color picker upper. You want to click the dropper and then you want to click on the color that you would like to take out. Like what's the color you want to vanish and instead be replaced? The recommendation from WeVideo is to pick the most Neut most blended version. Like if you pick a spot with lots of shadow, then it's not going to get the true color. So you want to pick the most like true version of that color, which I'm thinking like is right here. So I'm going to click there and right away I see that there it is. It's working. Okay. So right away it should work. If it doesn't, then you've done a little something wrong. Um, if for some reason, like it's not working, you could always click this guy again. Maybe, no, you can't. Well, whatever. Let me know if you have trouble. You can start over again. And then you want to click save changes. Okay. So now the green is gone. <laughs> and instead I have that control room in the background. Okay. Um, I'm going to make another video where I show you how to do this little, I call this pick and pick where you have a picture inside of a picture in that little window to the side. I'll show you to do that in the next video. But this video is all about how to take away the green in a green screen and put in a background. All right. Thanks.